part of the responsibility of being an astronaut is outreach and bringing the excitement and the thrill of space flight uh, to the next generation. Was it just exciting going into space the second time as it was the first? Was it as exciting going the second time? Yeah, every time is really exciting because, uh, uh, I mean, I would, uh, I would think about if I can go on another shuttle mission, I would love to do it because strapping into that thing and getting the ride in your life is cool and then uh, it's magic. You, un you unstrap, so eight and a half minutes, you know, you're in space, you open up your seat belt and you start, you float out of your seat and you, we're very busy, uh, but you get out of your suit and then uh, uh, if you have a free moment, you go to the window and you look out and there you are. Hundreds of miles above the Earth. We are the really lucky ones that get to go and live in space, and I feel it's our responsibility to bring that experience back and um, share tidbits of, of that experience with the taxpayers and and the the next generation who will uh, hopefully take this information and and uh, discover the next great thing and do the next uh, amazing uh, uh, feat. We're not expecting these kids to go and work in the space program. Some of them may, but but uh, if they get excited about this at the Challenger Center, about doing a mission, and it sparks their curiosity about learning something uh, and figuring out how to ask questions and uh, uh, what it means to be curious and what it means to uh, have fun learning, then. Uh, I think it's going to pay off big time in 15, 20 years when they choose careers and choose colleges and uh, I think the, the state and the nation, the country or the world will benefit by uh, sparking interest in something and, and, uh, and, and getting kids to, to learn.